everybody. I'm here with Dylan and Shaq, and I'm Devin. Today we'll be talking about the straight line amortization method. What is amortization? Amortization is the process of depreciating a tangible asset over a period of time divided by the cost. A tangible asset is a physical asset that is bought or sold. For example, a tangible asset is something that can be touched. An example of what amortization is, is buying a vehicle that depreciates in value over time. There are three methods used to calculate amortization, which are the straight line method, decline in balance, along with the units of activity. All three methods are accepted by GAAP. The straight line method is what we're going to be covering in this video. This method is fairly simple and, it's the, and it is the <laughs> most commonly used when determining depreciation. Under the straight line method, amortization is the same for each year of the asset's useful life. So each year will have the same depreciated value. So for example, this year, if the asset has $500 in its depreciated value and its useful life is five years, every year will be the same. And in order to calculate amortization expense, you have to find the amortizable cost. And the amortizable cost is the cost of the asset less its residual value. To find the annual depreciated expense, you will have to use the straight line formula, which is the cost of the asset subtract the residual value or salvage value, equaling the depreciable cost. And then you divide it by its useful life in years, giving you the annual, annual depreciated expense. And for those who don't know, salvage value is the estimate of the asset's value at the end of its useful life. And the depreciable cost is the uh, original cost of the tangible asset less its salvage value. This is an example of the straight line method. On January 1st, 2012, Fitzy Co. purchased computer equipment costing $10,000. It is expected to have a value of $2,000 at the end of five years. Calculate the depreciation expense on the equipment for the year end, December 31st, the year end of December 31st. First, we have to find the depreciable amount. To do that, we have to take the cost and subtract it by the salvage value, which gives us the depreciable cost. Then divide the depreciable cost by the useful life of the computer equipment. This will give you the annual depreciation. The second example, the computer equipment was purchased Later on in the fiscal year, it wasn't purchased at the beginning. To find the depreciable cost and the annual depreciation expense is about the same, but you have to do one more step. In example one, you would just find the annual depreciation expense. Then after you divide it by the amount of months and assets, the asset has been depreciated for by a full year in 12 months. Then you multiply the results by the annual depreciation. By now you should know uh, how the use of straight line amortization method, what is the amortization and the different types of amortization methods. <laughs>